Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever time of the day you're watching this video, this is Dr. Eric Tango Monkan with IEM Approach, where we inspire, equip, and motivate people to discover God's great potential in them, develop that potential, and deploy it. For you to get to the top, you need a daily dose of inspiration and motivation. Zig Ziglar said, motivation is like taking a bath. You take a bath every day. You need to keep your eye on the goal. You need to keep moving. I've been talking about knowing who you are. Jesus asked his disciples to tell him who people say he is. It's amazing the type of answers that the disciples gave him. Some say you are this, some say you are that. Some say you are Elijah, some say you are a great prophet. Blah, 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 blah. The only person who got it right was Peter. And Peter got it right because the Holy Spirit revealed to him who Jesus was. Now, where, where am I going with this? You don't have to allow people to tell you who you are. You don't have to allow social media to tell you who you are. You don't have to allow the psychologists, the sociologists, the economists, the anthropologists, the philosophers, whoever they are, to tell you who you are. If you allow society to tell you who you are, they will tell you you are black or you are white or you are green or you are yellow. Is that really who you are? The color of your skin? Really? I mean, some of us are so funny because we move around and, and we say, oh, I'm, I'm black, huh? Yeah, because of, no, you are not a color. Come on, you're more than that. I'm Asian, no, you're more than a continent. I'm European, no, you're more than a continent. You are not a continent. I'm white, you are more than a color. It doesn't matter what label they've given to you. I want you to look in the inside of you and figure out who you are. Because who you say you are is by far more important than what people say you are. There is a huge difference between those two. And who you are is who your creator says you are. God says, I have created you in my image and likeness. That is good enough. Stop allowing society and other people to give you an identity that is not yours. You are not your culture. You are not the food you eat. You are not the clothes you wear. All those things are external. You can change them. But you cannot change the image of God that has been stamped on you. I want you to rise up to this realization and start calling yourself by what God is calling you. When you value yourself, you understand the next thing I want to say. We are focusing on holistic success. Ditawa is part of IEM approach. Ditawa 100 days of clean eating and exercise challenge is on the way. This is day 40. And I want you, who is made in the image and likeness of God, to wake up and take care of God's temple. Your body is your responsibility. Get on the 30 days of raw food. It's going to change your life. It's changed mine. And I want you to benefit. My wife wrote this book. I highly, highly recommend it. A hundred days to freedom, yes. Within these 100 days, you're going to take back your freedom. Your self-esteem will go through the roof. You get freedom from medication. You get freedom from hypertension. You get freedom from high blood pressure. You get freedom from low libido. You get freedom from obesity, insulin resistance, you name it. Grab your copy today. This is the roadmap. Each day for the 100 days, you are going to be told what to do each day. No more complaining. Go on Amazon now. Order these books and change your life. God bless you. See you at the top.